sometimes we need a little flame to ignite inner fire, a light to illuminate a possible path or a companion to ease the journey. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome our fireman, Rene Mashecki. <laughs> Somehow I picked this up on the way here. Joe <laughs> guy. And it came with a set of instructions. I'm only allowed to wear it when I'm honoring my students. And this place. Here it is. And I'm so. I'm so moved, I, don't, I doubt if I can play this. I'll try. <laughs> going to read from my um, artist statement. It's called Zong Kdee, an artist statement by moi. <laughs> Today is Zong Kdee, when Zong Ge, strong, day, heart, a win, action, celebrates with you. My generation, I'm 65, woke up when we heard Houston, Tranquility Base here, the eagle has landed. And the Hopi prophecy, the truth of the sacred ways shall be revealed when the eagle lands on the moon. That historic event in the late 60s was our idol no more. We, Anishinaabe artists, started sobering up one by one and began to take our art seriously. Idol No More is spiritual. It began in 1492. Since then, each generation that understood it has celebrated the movement. It's been the celebration of indigenous and non-indigenous peoples coming together as stewards of Turtle Island. We are responsible for the upcoming generation of stewards of Turtle Island, North America. Young First Nations people are searching for their identity. This Songdeewen project has facilitated an exploration of Anishinaabe language, teachings, and expressions of identity using underpainting, symbols, stories, colors, rhythms, and mixed media with ac acrylic paints on canvas and boards. Songdeewen provided a non judgmental space where students could reflect on their deepest spirits and souls, allowing for their true and free selves to appear on canvas. Through Songdeewen, I've been privileged to see students conceptualize and create acrylic paintings that express the meaning of symbols representing their totem, e.g., Woke Clan or Bear Clan. This spiritual self-image supports their sense of well-being, their purpose in life, and their sense of belonging. We are responsible for the upcoming generation of stewards of Turtle Island, which is North America. Song Dewin and the Gallery of Hamilton are transformational and empowering spaces that validate First Nations students' identities. You should see the look in their eyes when you tell them your art will be hanging at the Art Gallery of Hamilton, the third largest public art gallery in Ontario. Yeah. Priceless. Yeah. 